President Muhammadu Buhari. The current economic challenges facing the country could only be addressed through the pacification of the economy, saying that Nigeria have no option but to go back to farming to achieve food security. And in food, Nigeria, we can feed ourselves and even export. That's why we have seriously turned to agriculture. The president expressed optimism that with the cooperation of traditional rulers and other stakeholders in the agricultural sector, the country could achieve sub-sufficiency in food production within the next two years. President Muhammad Buhari, who went into the memory lane, narrated how billions of dollars generated by the country were wasted on importation of food items that could be produced locally. Of course, I have been speaking to the governors to please make sure that any land that can be cultivated, let it be cultivated. He also called on mechanized farmers to go into establishment of agro-allied industries using farm products as their raw materials to boost employment opportunities in the country. Responding on behalf of traditional rulers, the Sultan of Sokoto, Alaji Saad Abu Bakr, assured the president that members of the traditional rulers' council will continue to partner with government for peace coexistence among the diverse ethnic groups in the country. And inshallah, with commitment to your oath, with justice, upholding of the principles of your religion, we believe you will, inshallah, leave this country a much, much better. He said the traditional rulers have resolved to continue to pray for the progress and survival of Nigeria as a geopolitical entity. The Sultan then thanked the President for inviting the traditional rulers from across the country to the Ramadan break of fast. From the State House Abuja, I am Hassan Umar Farouk for Liberty News.